the Sydney Opera House. A heritage wonder. A building that changed the image of a nation. Whether people come to performances here, whether they get married here or come here for birthdays, it is a very important part of our identity as a nation. For the first time, the Sydney Opera House has allowed cameras to go behind the scenes to reveal what it takes to run one of the world's busiest performing arts precincts. There's a couple of seals that have taken residency out on the VIP stairs. We've spent a year following the staff as they go above and beyond, bringing shows to life. Beyonce of the violin. <laughs> He's the Beyonce of the violin. Three weeks to go, which feels like no time at all. We've got a lot to do. How are you going? Don't ask. I'm just looking at that rain, going, what have I done? It's the countdown to complete the most expensive rebuild in the history of the house. Lou, that's amazing. The best case scenario is that it all goes off without a hitch. Do you expect to be that moved? I didn't. As a virus pushes everyone to breaking point. You haven't got the results? This is the most precarious situation I can remember in the company's history. How many floor relics have you missing? Eight. Uh, how many do you normally have? <laughs> Eight? Eight. That's a five! We tell the inside story of a troubled New Year's Eve. If they don't get the results back in 24 hours, good fireworks won't be happening. I just can't believe that it hasn't been canned already. Feel confident. It's going to go well. 